Porygon! Reverse how oddish. This is it, guys. The last pack of the day. Oh, we got a Feromosa and Buzzwall GX Secret Rare. Not the card I was looking for, but it's still a Secret Rare, so I think it counts as some last pack. Magic here with our Unbroken Bonds Mystery Pack, or was in the Mystery Pack. What is going on, Pokemon Card Nation? Welcome back to another video. It has been a long time since I've done one of these videos. Welcome back to Cash or Crap. Today, we have six mystery packs to open these all have a chance at vintage packs and a one in five chance at chase packs which i believe is vintage packs as well as stuff like dragon majesty shining legends who knows what else that could include now without further ado let's go ahead and get into these mystery packs they all have the platinum supreme victors pack art on the front which is a really cool set so if we do pull a platinum pack i would be really happy I might even open it. I might not. I'll have to decide. What I'll probably do is not open it and then hold on to it. What we're going to do is basically go through all the packs first and then we're going to open whatever we get. We have got a Burning Shadows pack, which I haven't been able to open too much of recently because they're kind of gone now. And a Foil Caterpie and a code card for a Burning Shadows Cosmog promo. Whoever gets that code card, have fun with your Cosmog. Moving on to the next one. I will open packs, don't worry guys. But the fun part about the mystery packs is you got to see what's inside them first. And we've got a Steam Siege. Not very cool, but it's still a Pokemon pack. Turfield Stadium Reverse Hollow. And a code card for whoever wants it. I see these almost as MJ Holding kind of being scalpers. Especially since they actually occasionally do have good stuff in them. And we've got a Fates Collide booster pack so i'll give them a little bit of a pass there absol reverse hollow none of these reverse hollows are worth that much code card for burning shadows cosmog is that what all the code cards are i kind of wonder now moving on to the next pack let's go come on let's get one one chase pack would be cool instead of steam siege these things cost like 8.99 so imagine paying nine dollars for steam siege like i did although i wouldn't be too mad if we pulled one of the cool cards from that set there are some cool cards in there sin dial Reverse Hollow. Looks like all the foils are reverses. This is a Lolan Meowth promo card code. It doesn't look like any of the codes are for booster packs. Ooh, we got Dragon Majesty, which is good. It's about a $30 pack right there. Justifies my purchase a little bit. We've got a Hatterim Reverse Hollow and a code card. I probably won't open the Dragon Majesty just for the simple fact that I don't really want to. And I think the pack art looks cooler than most of the cards that are in that set. There is a really cool gold Ultra Necrozma. Ooh, Unbroken Bonds. Wasn't ready for that. That's pretty cool. I probably will open this one. This is one of those packs that's probably good to keep sealed at this point, but I'm going to open it because I haven't been able to open that much of it. We've got a Reverse Samurott and a Code Card for it and a Lolan Meowth again. We'll start with what I consider the worst set, Steam Siege. We'll move to Fates Collide and then two chances at a Charizard. Let's go ahead and see if we got anything from Steam Siege. I'd like to know if there's anything good in here. Hopefully, it's that secret rare Gardevoir. I believe it's a Mega Gardevoir? Is it, maybe it's a regular Gardevoir EX. I don't remember anymore. There's also a, oh my gosh, I did the pack trick wrong. We got a Gardevoir EX. Forgot it was only three. Pokemon Ranger, Nuzleaf, Armor Fossil, Joltik. I'll go quick on this pack because I did it wrong. Bergmite, Fungus, Mankey, Shellos, Reverse Hollow Volcarona. That one's pretty cool too. I'd say that's a good pack. That's a good pack. Let me uh, sleeve up this Gardevoir. I like Gardevoir. Gardevoir is cool. I'll take that as a hit. That's a win in my book from Steam Siege for once. Not only that, this is actually a pretty good centered card. Other than top to bottom, the left... Oh, no, it's a little off. It looks good through my camera, but when I actually look at it, it doesn't look that good. So, never mind on that. Steam Siege again with our shiny Gardevoir on the cover. On the pack art, the cover. What am I talking about? Is this a book? I'll do the pack trick right, I promise. There's a code card for you. Let's see what we have here. Let's go, let's go. I did three, I think I did it right. Braviary, Dewat, Claw, Fossil, Anorith, Clauncher, C Dot, Nose Pass, Litleo. I kind of see something good in the back there in the corner. Dino, Break, Hydreigon Break, that's what I think I saw. And a Galvantula. The Break is pretty cool. I'm not sure how much the Hydreigon is worth. Usually these things are worth like a buck. Every once in a while, there's some that are worth like 10 or more. I believe Arcanine Break is worth at least 10. 
And I think Crobat Rake is worth a little bit too. I think those two are promos though. Although so far we're two for two, so that's that's a win in my book. Moving on to Fates Collide. As always, I'll throw prices up on screen so you guys will know for sure. And I won't just be talking out of my my left ear or whatever. And what was this Fates Collide? So Fates Collide has a really cool secret rare Alakazam. Has like an Umbreon in the background. There we go. I almost did it wrong. Uh, let's see what we got. We've got a Kabuto, Kangashkan, Random Receiver, Binacle, Bronzor, Burmy in a tree, Carbink, Larvitar, Reverse Hollow Tyranitar. I'll take that. I like Tyranitar. And an Altaria EX. There we go. Three for three so far. Can we keep going? Really what we need to do is end this off with a bang. Two Charizard hits from Burning Shadows. One from Burning Shadows and one from Unbroken Bonds. At least we know these packs aren't messed with. Let's see what's in the Burning Shadows booster pack. Let's go. Let's go. Is it something good? We've got a code card. I don't want to see the color of the code. I don't need to know. I'll know when we get to the back. Please be Charizard. I've been hunting that card forever. Not a huge Charizard fan, but when you hunt the card forever. I'm trying to complete Burning Shadows as a set. I really need that card. Escape Rope. Windpod, Vulpix, Meowth taking a stroll down some stairs, Riolu on the beach, Alolan Grimer, Reverse Hollow Olivia, and an Electivire. Still no Charizard, but Electivire's cool. Wish it was a Hollow. It's not, but I wish it was. Unbroken Bonds. Now this set I'm looking for Reshiram Charizard, or I am also looking for the alternate art cards that are in the set. I believe there's a Reshiram Charizard alternate art as well as a Sylveon. Who is Sylveon a tag team with? Gardevoir. Sylveon and Gardevoir, I think, is the other one I'll be looking for. There's your code, Unbroken Bonds. Good luck with it. Hope you find something good. Let's see what we have in this last pack. We've got a Fighting Energy, Triple Acceleration Energy, Energy Spinner. We did break our streak with our last pack, but maybe we'll get some last pack magic here. Growlithe, Cubone, Riolu, Porygon. Reverse Hollow Oddish. This is it, guys. The last pack of the day. Oh, we got a Feramosa and Buzzwall GX Secret Rare. Not the card I was looking for, but it's still a Secret Rare, so I think it counts as some last pack. Magic here with our Unbroken Bonds Mystery Pack, or was in the Mystery Pack. This, along with our other hits and our Dragon Majesty Pack, give us a bit of a win today, you guys. I don't think I could ask for a better set of hits. On I mean, I could ask, but I did pretty well, so... These mystery packs were peak for me, not gonna lie. Not gonna lie. Very awesome hit. Let's take a minute and go through our pulls. We've got the Dragon Majesty pack, which is worth like 30 bucks, 35. Feramosa and Buzzwall GX Secret Rare, Altaria EX, Hydreigon Break, and a Gardevoir EX. I think this counts as a win. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comment section below. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to hit the like button, leave a comment, and subscribe, and don't forget to hit the notification bell. I would really appreciate that. Thanks for watching. Have a good one.